It's late, hon. Your parents will be worried. Well, there he is. You make any new friends, sweetheart? Nothing to say, huh? What a surprise. It's late, sweetie. Go on up to bed and I'll be there to say goodnight. Good night, little man. I hope you're as happy as we are. Everything is going to be better now that we're in this quiet little mountain town. I'm having the dream again. Okay, this is dreamy. What's happening? Oh, Jesus! Jesus Christ! Oh, can we try the big silver one again? Is this your first time getting probed? Yeah, it's a pain, but this is the kind of stuff you put up with living in a remote little mountain town. At least we don't have to deal with traffic. Hey, you broke free! Kid, you have an incredible control of your asshole! Get me loose, too! Wow, look at that! You must have broke off part of the probe and now you can control it with your sphincter muscle. I'm surrounded by some kind of force field. Go find a way to shut it off. When you break me free, I can show you how to get off the ship. Moo moo. Great, you're in. You're looking for a security console. Should be one above you in probe maintenance and another below you in the atmospheric processor. Yeah, I know this stuff. Can't remember which one you want, though. Been a while since I did this.
Is this recording? If you are hearing this, I've been taken hostage on some kind of alien ship. The aliens did unspeakable things to my rectal cavity. But I've broken free. I'm so scared and alone. I must find a way off this ship. Oh god, they're coming. Why am I standing here making an audio log? I don't have time for this. Leave me alone! The only thing I've found are other people's annoying, useless audio logs. Why did they bother when they clearly were in terrible danger? Each audio log I find is more irrelevant and boring than the last. I must keep looking for a way to survive. You're there! See if you can free me from- T.I.E! Oh god, no! no. Oh, shut it off! Keep going, I think you're onto something. I knew I could trust you. Keep it up! Uh, I'm still stuck. Better try the other console. Okay, that one doesn't work either. Head back towards the elevator. Okay, I didn't want you to have to do this, but there's one more console you can try in that room across the bridge. The alien who works there is really tough, so be careful and remember to use electricity. Moo, moo. Hey, 
Hey, that did it. The force field's down. Come on back and we can get out of here. It's another Saturday night. Feeling all right. Feeling okay. Great, you made it. Okay, use this panel here and we can all go home. Oh, you did it! Oh, thanks, kid. I don't know who you are or if you're real, but consider me your friend. Until we meet again! Okay, I did find one audio log that was mildly amusing. A woman trapped on this ship left an audio log about some paper she had left in an alien cabinet, and she told me the code was 776. That was kind of cool because I didn't know the code before that. So when I opened the cabinet... Yes? At what location? How many people in the town? Get in there and cover it up. This could change everything. Get everyone moving! We've got another UFO crash. God, they came out of nowhere. There was a huge earthquake, and then, and then there was burning in my yard. Didn't you hear about it? It's all over the news. Here, look. And that a large earthquake and several fires in the South Park area last night woke many residents from their sleep. 
Here with the report is a midget in a bikini. Tom, government workers here are assuring everyone nothing out of the ordinary has happened. They claim that the only reason huge tents have gone up to cover this area is to mask the construction of a new Taco Bell, which will open sometime later this month. Thanks, midget. I do love me some Taco Bell. The mayor of South Park states that last night's tremors and fires are under control and that hopefully schools and businesses can open again soon. It's horrible. You don't understand. The elves, they took the stick. And it's bullshit because that is totally cheating. We specifically said no trying to take the stick at night. Elves are dirty little liars and we have to lay waste to their entire base. You have some incredible ability to make friends quickly, Sir Douchebag. I'm sending you on a quest to go out into the lands of Zaron and recruit a whole nother faction to Koopa Keep. Find the goth kids and give them this letter. Get them to join our kingdom and we shall lay waste to the drow elves once and for all! Fucking cheaters. Hello, Timmer. Timmer! I used to be sad, but I found Jesus at the church. coming to visit, but here, every day is Christmas, so when I say howdy ho, you gotta say, howdy ho, Mr. Hanky, give it a try, howdy ho. Hmm, guess they let anybody down in the sewers these days. Who's at the door? Is that the guy with my pills? No, it's not anyone with pills for you, darling, okay? I called that my this is my lovely wife, Autumn. She celebrates Christmas with vodka and muscle relaxers. And here, every day is Christmas. Wait, where the fuck are my kids? What do you mean, where are the kids? You're supposed to be watching them out back, Autumn. No, they were being watched by the babysitter. The babysitter quit four months ago when you threw up on her. Don't you fucking yell at me! Don't you excuse us a minute. Don't you ever embarrass me by the screen, you like that? You don't got him, and you don't know where you can go. Fuck you, they're your kids, too, you piece of shit. Don't you fuck you, I'll fuck you. Howdy ho! Uh, listen, I gotta get my wife some help. <laughs> Could you go look for our children? 
I sure would make it worth your while. They're Simon, Amber, and Cornwallis. Tell them their father wants them home right away. My babies! Bring me my babies! <laughs> You're a fucking train wreck! Put that 
that bass down. Put that bass down. Nice work. I will let you know of any updates on Manbearpeg. Make sure to share the news on Facebook. I'm super serial. Done. The galaxy is in your debt. Let it be known that I have been and will always be your friend on Facebook.
damn if you ain't a noble knight after all. All right, kid, here you go. A guide at South Park Wildlife is everything a hunter needs to know about the beasts of Central Colorado. Got some things for sale might help your hunt. Kill anything in that guide, you come back and see old Jimbo and Ned. The best part of hunting is bragging about it to other hunters. What can I do for you, new kid? Who's that? I think it's that new kid people are talking about. Beat it, new kid. This area is strictly for goth kids. What's this? Join the Kingdom of Koopa Keep to battle the wicked elves. All recruits welcome. Sorry, Frodo. We don't play Dungeons and Douchebags. Yeah, beat it, new kid. Aw, oh, come on. Let's do it. We never do anything. No way. We can't do what this kid asks us to do. He's a conformist. Look at his clothes and his hair. Yeah, I'll tell you what, new kid. Get the right clothes and some cigarettes and coffee and then talk to us again. Yeah, if you want to prove you aren't a conformist, then you need to look exactly like we do. Then maybe we'll consider hanging out with you. I'll give you a good price.
Welcome to my coffee shop. Thanks for helping Tweak out in the back room. Would you like to try some coffee? Hey, there he is. New kid. New kid. The Elf King has requested your presence. You can either come quietly or you can fight. But I warn you, fighting this fight at this point in the game is a complete waste of time, and you might as well skip it and just come with us. You chose wisely, new kid. Come with us. So, you're the new kid everyone is talking about. What's your name? He doesn't talk, Elf King. He thinks he's hot shit or something. You're playing for the wrong side, dude. What did Wizard Fatass tell you? That we broke the rules and took the stick last night? He's lying. Cartman is the one you should be fighting against. He's hiding the stick, which is cheating, and acting all betrayed and sad to get you to recruit more people for him. We tracked a Twitter raven who says you are currently trying to recruit the Goths for the Wizard. Go recruit them, but bring them to us. Then we can ransack Carbon's stupid kingdom and get the stick back once and for all. I'm trusting you to do what's right. And kid, if you betray us, we'll tell everyone you're a butthole. I am sending our best ranger to help guide you. The bard is also at your disposal now. I guess that's cool. Let's 
Last cigarette. You guys got more? Get lost, kid. We're trying to smoke here. Take your stupid hair and leave. Take your stupid hair and leave. Ah! Rangers do not fear death. Oh, Joy, it's Butthole the Barbarian from the Dungeons of Dumbass. You gotta admit, he looks better. Yeah, he's almost a goth. Being goth isn't just how you dress, it's a frame of mind. It's time for you to prove that you go against society's rules. Yeah. There's a big PTA meeting happening right now at the community center. You need to walk right into the middle of that meeting and tape this sign to their table. Yeah, that will prove your individuality. Go on, beat it. And don't come back until you have a picture of that sign taped to the PTA table. There's some weirdo hanging out at the public storage. I'm not going back there. Butter's got a horrible Snuggie over there. Uh, yeah, have fun in there. I think I'll wait it out. It isn't right, I tell you. Out of nowhere, this huge Taco Bell is being built, and now our children are missing precious school time. Parents, we've been assured by the builders that they're working to fix whatever problems they've encountered, and school should be able to resume soon. Resume soon? Who do they think they are? They think we're gonna see a, a Taco Bell as being more important than our kids' educations? What if it's not really a Taco Bell we're dealing with? Thanks for coming, new kid. Everyone, this is the kid whose family just moved to town. We've become very close friends. His name is... what's your name? Well, anyway, this child and I witnessed something last night, and I'd like you to hear his story. Go ahead, kid. Tell them, you know, about all the... Go ahead, tell them, tell them that stuff. This is a waste of everyone's time. If the PTA isn't going to do something about Taco Bell taking over, then the rest of us parents will! Come, Come on! Let's yeah. go! Come on! I saw you on the ship. You have pretty good control over- Look, I know how you're feeling, okay? But this isn't gonna solve anything. We've got to get inside that Taco Bell and find out what's really going on. Help me with that and I'll help you with this. I saw you on the ship. You have pretty good control over your farts. Meet me in the bathroom. It's time for you to learn some real power. I can tell you have potential, but you are undisciplined. Let me show you what I mean. Come at me. Try and fart on me. Come on! <laughs> Hi, Cha! See that? Your fart's over there somewhere. Didn't come close. So, what do you do when people can block your farts? You must learn to control your farts to move and release at a specific time and place. I'm going to teach you a fart called the Sneaky Squeaker. It will become your greatest ally. Don't believe me? Try and block my attack. <laughs> you see that? I distracted you. Distracting your opponents is key to battle. Look, let me show you again. Pay special attention to the viscosity. <laughs> Okay, you try. Make your fart detonate behind me.
Oh, hey, guys. Oh, Mr. Mackey? Now it's your turn. Use Sneaky Squeaker to distract Mr. Mackey over to the corner there. Hey, did you guys hear that? Sounded like a chipmunk. Gia! Very, very good. Now use what I taught you to sneak inside that Taco Bell. Find out what they're up to and report back here. And no matter what happens, never fart on anyone's balls. You got that? All right, now go. A Taco Bell, can you believe it?